कैट ट्वेंटी टू स्लॉट वन क्वान्टिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवेंटीन इन अ क्लास ऑफ हंड्रेड स्टूडेंट्स सेवेंटी थ्री लाइक कॉफी एटी लाइक टी एंड फिफ्टी टू लाइक लेमन एट इट मे बी पॉसिबल दैट सम स्टूडेंट्स डो नॉट लाइक एनी ऑफ दीज थ्री ड्रिंक्स देन द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द मैक्सिम एंड मिनिमम पॉसिबल नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स टू लाइक ऑल द थ्री ड्रिंक्स नाउ दिस इज अ क्वेश्चन बेस्ड ऑन इंक्लूजन एंड एक्सक्लूजन लेट्स ड्रॉ अ वेन डायग्राम फर्स्ट सो वी हैव three circles representing people or students who drink coffee tea and lemonade respectively coffee tea and lemonade we are told this number is 52 this number is 80 and this number is 73 so now let us say people who do not like to drink anything because we are not told that how many students do not like any of these three drinks so let us say people who do not like any of the three drinks are a b represents the number of people who represents who like exactly one of the drinks c represents the number of people who like exactly two drinks and d represents the number of people who like exactly three drinks so this is d these three together is represented by c and those who like exactly one drink is represented by b obviously a plus b plus c plus d this must be equal to 100 now looking at this venn diagram i can say that b plus 2 times c plus 3 times d must be equal to 73 plus 80 plus 52 that makes it 205 just subtract equation 1 from equation 2 and you will get c plus 2d minus a is equal to 105 now in this equation what can be the maximum possible value of d the maximum possible value of d can be 52 let us see whether it's possible d is equal to 52 now do not jump to a conclusion you have to see whether this is possible also or not so mostly it will be possible c minus a must be equal to 1 from this third equation so if c minus a is 1 we also have a plus b plus c plus 52 as 100 which means a plus b plus c must be equal to 48 and i can write c as a plus 1 in this equation so i'll get a plus b plus a plus 1 as 48 so 2a plus b is equal to 47 will there be multiple values for a and b yes there can be multiple values for a and b therefore d is equal to 52 is indeed the maximum number <coughs> now what about the minimum number for minimum value let us start by taking d is equal to 0 if d is equal to 0 c minus a is 105 which is impossible why because none of the two values can go beyond 100 so d is equal to 1 c minus a will be how much 103 which is again not possible d is equal to 2 then c minus a must be equal to 101 not possible d is equal to 3 then c minus a is 99 is that possible we'll need to check so if you check for c minus a as 99 we also have a plus b plus c plus d as 100 which means a plus b plus c the maximum value can only be 97 so which means in under no circumstance can c minus a be equal to 99 so this is not possible you will see that taking d is equal to 4 will also have a similar result but when d is equal to 5 what happens when d is equal to 5 c minus a gives you 95 and now you have a plus b plus c is equal to 95 here you can take c as 95 and a as 0 and satisfy this equation also so the minimum possible value of d is 95 please do not forget to check the minimum possible value of d of 
those who drink all the three drinks is 5 and therefore the required answer is 52 minus 5 that is 47.